Here I am with Havoc, and he's showing me his latest crazy, crazy thing. Whoa. What's this thing? It looks like, it looks like that Stargate bridge from SG-1. No, Atlantis. And they had a Stargate in each end. What is this? Is it this, has... Is it a stealth ship? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Where's the reactors, man? You genius. Uh, they're inside it? <laughs> I've hidden them in the... Uh, in the in the in the circle all the way along, you just can't see it. You see on the ends, um, those like there's lines on each uh, end. Yes. Extend in. Uh, you see how like there's like a a widened part at three of them. Yeah. Like one of, them, and then there's a circle going around it, and uh, one of them. Those are all going to be layers. Okay. Eventually, that that run the length of the ship, be similar to the exterior layer. Um. And they're all going to be solid, and this ship's going to be really, really massive. <laughs> so what's the uh, concept with this? Uh, the concept is uh, AMC and missile defense, really. Oh, okay. Both. So just defense, really, all against right. everything. Well, <laughs> oh, blind, blind me. how long did it take to make this? Uh, to make this, I spent probably a good 12 hours on it. Yeah, I was gonna say you've got the you got it right. It looks great. It'll be interesting to see what you end up doing with this beast. All right then. Well, can't wait to see where this goes. So we're gonna take a look at a few more of Havoc's ships. So here's another one of his. What's this one called? Uh, it doesn't have a name either. I don't need my ships. So it's a salvaging ship. Yes. It looks a bit like the. Has um, it looks a bit like that stealth ship you made ages ago. Yeah, um, it also has weapons. Don't be in front of me. You want to see them? Which <laughs> way is in front of you? That way. Yeah, I thought it would be that way. Okay, right. Let's see that. Oh, jeez. Do you know what? We need to do a ballistics test on this thing. No this is name. what salvages look like. And it's got salvages as well. What's the uh, mass? Uh, forty-four hundred. 400. It's got a nice color scheme as well. What? Well, that was one click. Yes, that was one click. Gee. All right. So give me one second of fire, please, if you could. Oh wow. <laughs> well, I want to see this, but I don't want to take and teleport in and lag the sector down. It's all right. I'll I won't destroy the water blocks. So you can come and take a look at it. Um, I'm going to spawn another water block for you to do the sustained fire test on because that's a really interesting pattern you've just created. And uh, let's see. And lag. And lag. And lots of lag. There's no. It's a what? It's a bunch of single block AMCs, is what it is. Oh, right, so, okay, fine. I, I don't think it can uh -oh, make it. Oh, something happened there. I shot again. Yeah. Right, there we go, he's made it through, and uh, yeah, he's still got the whole back end of that ship to build, but hey, that weapon looks really promising. So, what, have you got other things to show me? Uh, I think I do, maybe. Um, yeah, I do, yeah, I do. It Definitely. wouldn't have been a very good link if you didn't. Oh! Oh, is this the next evolution of Trinity? No, this is a small Trinity. <laughs> it's a micro Trinity. Yeah, it's, it is. I like the detail on it more, mate, to be honest. This one looks cool. It actually looks a little bit better than Trinity. Sorry. <laughs> you can hate me for saying that, but I think so it's because you put, you put all this extra detail over the shell on here and these little fins, they look epic. You should do that on Trinity, but bigger. Those little and a fins floating will docking have port for a turret. Hey? Those little fins will have turrets on them. What, is that like yeah. the gimbal? What do you mean, like the gimbal? That thing attaches there, yeah, it does. I like it. Go, 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 just put it near it. <laughs> shot first, please. One click. Oh, yes. 
One click. <laughs> that whoa, that was ridiculous. Again, like. Uh, okay, for the sake of. Wait there a second, please. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, oh really? 39, 40, it's hard to count, uh, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, that's the record. It's just, it's just off of one click, that's the longest. Most people don't get that kind of penetration out of a second. My stealth ship gets more. But yeah, it's I know. You're, well, okay, yeah, true, actually. You're, that one did does hold the record, but we, that's a bit of a glitch, isn't it? Because it's... Uh, isn't it a glitch? Like, wasn't it yeah. an, it's an unexpected behaviour of physics or something? <laughs> it's like you yeah. managed to break it. Um, and we'll do a second. But yeah, that's, that's crazy. Most people get said between 7 and 21, depending on how OP they made their, their uh, AMC. And then, um, is that, that's not a second. Yeah, it was. Oh yeah, you're, yeah, of course. It's lag monster. So, okay. Well. I hit it at more of an angle. That's like a third of the block. Easily, nearly half between a third and a half. So I mean, I'd estimate that between between seventy and ninety, something like that. Between sixty and ninety blocks is worth of damage. I don't know exactly, but it's two hundred long. So please do. So everyone's starting to ask us what's going on in this sector, on account of all the messages. Right, the game has caught up with us. It didn't die, which is nice. Um, Unlike a certain other thing Havoc did a while back. <laughs> so here we are. He's made it through. Actually, the core died before the damage <laughs> appeared, which was quite funny. Um, but I couldn't record it because the frame rate was ridiculous. So there we have it. He's bust through there. Um, another server killing weapon from Havoc. <laughs> so I'll give him a round of applause. <laughs> what I want you to do is give it one click and then where my core is now just spray from top to bottom on a continuous pulse where I am there. That's it. That's beautiful. So I reckon if you're firing with a turret, it's going to be shooting like it's always going to be moving, isn't it? So I want to see what it's like to cut across the armor, and that's pretty good if you get the shields down and you're going up against normal hull. That's a savage amount of damage that turret does. It's absolutely savage. And what's interesting about it is that the one, the one click, it's one click no matter where it lands. Shoot until you go through the block. But don't move? Yeah, don't don't move. Just straight through. And you're through. That's a beast. <laughs> that carves through faster than most ships five times that size. Easy. Like we've had a few ships on there on here doing this ballistics test. Look at the range of That was so just his turret. <laughs> Oh, a range test, hello. So, we're gonna do some uh, long range tests. This is a new concept of testing we've come up with. So I've got a ballistics gel in front of the Trinity. Uh, this one is 500 meters, this one is 1,000 meters, and the last one is about 1,500 meters. It's actually out of his view range, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and... <laughs> Could you F me up, dude? <laughs> yeah, I have you selected. Cool. Right now, if you would like to take a shot at me, please. Now? Not just yet. I'm just, as a safety precaution, safety first, everyone. God mode. <laughs> I'm going to place a uh, slash god underscore mode, my name, and then it's true. Okay. 
Yep. It's gonna lag because I'm gonna. You're right yep. behind the first ballistic still, you know. Yeah, yeah. I know I am. So you can aim aim at me and fire. Okay. Ready? Yep. Tell me when you fire. I am. Okay. That's it. Stop. Whoa. Stop firing. Okay, so we ripped a huge hole through it. A triangular hole. That's awesome. Have you seen the hole on this thing? <laughs> you want to see the pattern from the side. That looks special. Alright, cool. So, there it is. Right, so, that's a direct hit. So keep your uh, selection on me. Can you still see me? Yep. Tell me what the uh, distance reading is now. 1200. Okay, so, so this one's 1200 away. 1, I can just about see you. Okay, aim at me. It's 1420 right and now. Take, take your best shot, bro. I don't think I can hit it. You're hitting it. You can stop oh. shooting now. I actually am. Look at that. So, we're going to do some uh, long range tests. This is a new concept of testing we've come up with. So, I've got a ballistics gel in front of the Trinity. Uh, this one is 500 meters, this one is 1000 meters, and the last one is about 1500 meters. It's actually out of his view range, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and. <laughs> Could you F me up, dude? <laughs> yeah, I have you selected. Cool. Right now. If you would like to take a shot at me, please. Now? Not just yet. I'm just, as a safety precaution, safety first, everyone. God mode. <laughs> I'm going to place a uh, slash god underscore mode, my name, and then it's true. Okay. Yep. It's going to lag because I'm going to, you're right yep. behind the first ballistic still, you know. Yeah, yeah. I know I am, so you can aim aim at me and fire. Okay, ready? Yep, tell me when you fire. I am. Okay. That's it. Stop. Whoa. Stop firing. Okay, so we ripped a huge hole through it. A triangular hole. That's awesome. Have you seen the hole on this thing? <laughs> you want to see the pattern from the side. That looks special. All right, cool. So there it is. Right, so that's a direct hit. So keep your uh, selection on me. Can you still see me? Yep. Tell me what the uh, distance reading is now. 1,200. Okay, so, so this one's 1,200 away. 1, I can just about see you. Okay, aim at me. It's 1420 right yeah, now. Take take your best shot, bro. I don't think I can hit it. You're hitting it. You can stop oh. shooting now. I actually am. Look at that shit. Let's have a look. I wasn't, um, it's spread fire. It wasn't actually, um... It was spread fire. I couldn't target it. It's too far away. It's too the far game. away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're nearly 2,000 meters away from Havoc's ship. And he's just sat there shooting at me because I'm on the, I'm on the scan now. Same gun, same ship. The only thing that's changed is the range. And as you can see, with only a few hits, we're getting a completely different pattern and a severe reduction in either the number of projectiles or the amount of damage that they're inflicting because it's taking more shots to get through less. Uh, uh, less of the gel. So I mean, if I look at that there, that was that was hits from about a second of fire. If I go back down to the other gel, I can't remember how far the you distance. It. No, I didn't. I, I removed the one in the middle because it was just so laggy. Here, yeah, look at this. This one is about 800 meters from his core. He fired at this for a second, and it penetrated through it like a space shotgun. Boom, exploded out the other side. It's something I was thinking about the other day. Like if you're approaching someone and you're gonna have a fight and people start opening up, you open up on the little square, don't you? You don't wait for his ship to load. <laughs> yeah. 
Right, you probably go, ah, a block has loaded there. That's where I'm shooting. <laughs> you don't wait for it to load fully in a real combat. That's strange, because this... I'm, I'm in my weapons computer. Surprisingly, it's not lagging. And yeah. it says my range is 850. And you're... Yeah, but that's the thing. It's... I don't think that, um... That's your optimal range. So I reckon if we had a... Um, you'd probably get, get that explosive effect that you did on the first gel up to 800 meters. And then after that, it'll start doing this. So this is the defensive gel. Um, Havoc set this up to simulate, I guess, armor piercing and, crew uh, and compartment it. walls. Yeah. That's what that's what the layers of my turtle ship you. Um, the, oh, so this is what the layers like. look like in your other ship. Will look like when they're done. Ah, uh, okay, cool. Water being um, power, shields, thrusters, that kind of stuff. Oh, okay. Well, well, I think those things actually. Well, never mind. Never mind. Right, cool. So this is to see with the reinforced around your systems what's going to get damaged. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Right, so I am looking at it from an angle where I can see a reasonable amount, and you. So go ahead. That's one shot. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, what, mate? You've got to check this out. I'm going into build mode. Holy mother of God! That's one shot, and it made it farther than one I thought it would. One shot. Bang! Straight through. <laughs> Bang! Straight through. Bang. Straight through. Still expanding. We've got a few holes in the middle that haven't been taken out. That's interesting. Uh, bang, bang, bang. And it looks like it's stopped short. Dude, the final layer held. <laughs> the final layer held, man. The final layer of this one click was stopped by that bit of armor plating right there. <laughs> That's beautiful. I like that. Well, I think we might have to uh, add that to the testing as well, so we can really look at what one click does. Because it's sort of like we've exploded. It's like an exploded diagram of the gel. Do you think it makes any difference to the projectile's performance by splitting it out? Or do you think it doesn't make any difference when it tries uh, through air? Barely. You see, um, it barely affects it. You see the, um, you mentioned the gaps that yeah. started to happen. Um, that's, that was the entire theory behind me making it, and it, it kind of works. Um, because you can see, like, I didn't aim at the core. I aimed close to the core, but if I had aimed at the core, yeah. by the time I made it to the core, if it made it all the way through, the core would be safe. Yeah. Around the core would be destroyed. But the core would be safe. Um, yeah, yeah. That was the... The point is, if someone takes a shot at you with a really big gun, <laughs> a.k.a. your ship, it won't... You know, if your ship's moving, it ain't getting through. No. That's... If you're that's... sat still, it's getting through. But then... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So that's, that's really cool. I like that defensive gel. I might start using that in my review videos, dude. Because it's another, it's another, another test. And I'm looking for for more tests to add to a standardised format. Yeah.